Please come and sit down. Sit down. Thank you. Hey, it's over 15 years. We buried my husband. Afterwards, nobody saw him. Where hey, have you been? I'm sorry. I've not come to see you for quite some time now. How are you doing? I'm very fine. Thank God for his mercy. And what is it in your hand? My Bible. Tell me, are you born again? By this special grace of God. Yes. Praise God. Hallelujah. This is what we have been praying for. Thank God for his oh, Please come with me. I must share this in the house fellowship. Sister Rita. Not understand, brethren. I have a testimony to share. This brother standing here with me is a man. His name is well known in this country. His name is Bob Ude. He is a shaman and managing director of Ocean Motors. Don't wonder about how such a highly placed man came to visit me. Of course, you know I am highly placed too by my Lord Jesus. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. This is the man my husband was running after to convert 15 years ago. On the day we were taken to the church, the devil struck and really fought to keep his soul. In this battle, my husband lost his life. This brother could not go back to the church. He went back to the world. But brethren, when the Lord shows mercy, I mean when the Lord shows mercy in the life of a man, the devil can only delay his salvation. Amen. So is the life of this brother. The seed that was sown in his life 15 years ago has germinated. Amen. Amen. The battle is over. Amen. Our brother is saved and converted. Amen. The battle is over. Amen. I said the battle is Amen. over. Amen. I know it is true. My husband is not alive in flesh to witness this victory. But I rejoice with the host of heaven. What shall I say? Unto the Lord, all I have to say is thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. All I have to say is thank you, Lord. Please, let's go. No, Sister Rita, I have a testimony to share with the people. Really? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I thank God for his grace to be in your midst. Like Sister Rita rightly said, there had been a great battle over my soul. And this battle has taken away many lives. I hated the Christians and persecuted them much. Each time I looked back into my past and counted my evil, I said to myself, I am not worthy to receive God's mercy. But God, in his infinite wisdom, long suffering and love showed mercy to me and led me to Christ. That is why I have come to make restitution to this family and especially to you, Rita. Your husband was my friend, a close friend and a business partner too. I lured him into partnership and our partnership was evil. We were doing well before he repented and became born again. I persuaded him to change his decision but he refused and held firm to eternal life. He gave me words of eternal life and sowed the seed in my heart. But when he left, the devil came in and brought confusion into my life. He showed me the loss I would make in my businesses and the shame that would come upon me if I repented and confessed my sins. Then I agreed with him to kill Paul. Armed robbers did not kill Paul. I masterminded the incidents that led to his death. I am a killer, a robber, and a fraud. Your husband was my close friend. He fought the battle of my soul. I killed a soldier who has come to save my life. When he saw me standing with death, he was not moved. He cared not for himself. But me, he beckoned on me and said, Bob, please, seek Jesus. Oh, I'm very sorry, sit down.
It is well, is well with my soul. With my soul, it is well. It is well with my soul. It is well. It is well with my soul. With my soul, it is well. It is well with my soul. It's like a river, and tell. See you.